A local gun range is finding itself in a legal duel with the state of Minnesota. Under the current executive order, sporting and entertainment venues are required to be closed. But as CBS3's John Cardinelli found out, the gun range's owner is willing to go the distance to stay open due to how he defines his business. Dead on Arms and Cloquet is all about gun safety. We need to be trained in how to use them and how to carry them, and the public needs to be trained. That's exactly what this place is. Like most businesses during the pandemic, on April 8th, Dead on Arms was ordered to close by Executive Order 2033. It actually said indoor shooting ranges, at which time we did, we, we closed because that was the initial wave of COVID. But after the most recent emergency order, Owner Chad Walsh decided it didn't apply to his business and stayed open. You need to figure out where you fit in here. You need to close down immediately. That's what we were told. Walsh was sent a letter by the Minnesota Attorney General's office on December 4th. They said he violated the state's order as his business classifies as a sports facility. Walsh says that his shooting range here isn't a sports facility as shooting a firearm can be deadly. There is a side to the firearms industry which is sporting. That would be sporting clays. And we don't offer that here. This is a place for people to come and get proficient with their firearm and train to learn how to use it. Walsh, with the direction from an attorney, has since sent a letter of his own to the Attorney General's office stating, Dead on Arms takes the position that use of the firing range is not prohibited by the executive order. If the order is amended to close indoor firing ranges, Dead on Arms will certainly comply. Walsh says he is prepared to battle the state in court. We do have a constitutional right to bear arms and a right to lawfully use a firearm in these times. We reached out to the Attorney General's office for reaction. We did not hear back by news time.